the Harry and Meghan documentary, there's a lie in there that is so infuriating to me, I can't even, I can't even. But one lie I know for sure, because it is my business, is when she talks about the Portland hospital, which is where she gave birth to Archie. Now the Portland hospital is a terrible hospital, let them come for me, I have receipts. I work as a parenting coach and sometimes that involves being there for the birth, being there in the weeks after the birth, being a hands-on maternity nurse person. I have lots of clients who want to give birth at the Portland Hospital because it's the celebrity hospital. And I tell them, absolutely not, it's a terrible hospital. Quite frankly, it's dangerous. If they want a private birth, um, they can go to the Kensington Wing at the Chelsea and Westminster, or they can go to the Lindo Wing at St Mary's, which is where the Royal Family deliver. Because the Portland Hospital doesn't have an emergency department. So, if you are a high-risk birth, or something happens during that labour to either you or your baby, there's no crash team, there's nothing. They will call an ambulance and you'll be sent to the nearest NHS hospital. So when Megan was talking about all oh, the emergency department, that's why we couldn't um, do the photograph in front of the hospital. There is no emergency department. That's an absolute lie. Also, when she said, oh, my doctor works out of the Portland, so that's where I had to deliver. Another lie. All those doctors are private doctors. They will go to whichever hospital you want to deliver and you will pay for the room, for the labour, the C-section, theatre room, etc. You pay for that and you pay for the doctor. The doctors don't specifically work out of one hospital or another. They'll go wherever. You go to the Portland if you want clout, which is why I don't work with clients who insist on delivering at the Portland. I don't know why she lied about this, but she lied.